Hello everyone and thanks for joining me today. This is just a reveal. I've owned it already for a little bit of time um, and it's not a fresh item from the store. It's from a couple of years ago already. So it's a, a pre-loved item of course, but it's a Speedy 20. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Um, I want to know from the experts and I'm not an expert. Why is this lettering in gold as opposed to black? All of my other boxes have black lettering and I noticed when I received this one um, it came with gold lettering, so I'm not sure why. Does anybody know why there's gold foil on this one as opposed to the regular black? Please help me out if you can. So anyway, um, maybe it wasn't even original to this particular item. I have no idea, or maybe it was. Um, so I added a Speedy 20. I already have three others in my collection, and I guess I've pretty much come to the conclusion that the Speedy 20 is my favorite LV bag. It's the perfect size for me. I did own the 25, and I did like it, but I found it too large. My stuff was like moving around and shifting in it all the time um, because I don't carry that much. So I found that it was just too big for me. And then when I size down to the 20, finally, it's the perfect size for what I carry. Um, and still I have space left over. So the one that I added is, I don't even remember now the collection that it came from, you guys. But it's the large monogram, the giant monogram, in the um, blue navy or the navy nacra. The metallic type blue that came out with the black. And I had purchased it at the time it came out. I did. I purchased it brand new. And I didn't like it. Um, and I opted for the uh, key clay instead. And then I eventually got rid of the key clay because it started to wear, actually. I wonder how all of you guys who own this one, how it's holding up. But my key clay started to look pretty worn in this uh, navy color. And I wasn't too impressed with how it wore. Um, but I do like it enough to have repurchased it, obviously, in the Speedy. Um, and I loved the color. And I'm hoping that this one will wear a little bit better. So anyway, this is the one I picked up. It's obviously the Speedy 20 in the Navy. And you can only get it pre-loved now because it was from an older collection. And here's the strap with a bit of chain to it. And it's blue and silver, which is a really great combination. I love the combination of blue and silver. And came pre-loved, but with all its little goodies. And here's the key and the lock in here. So lock and keys in there and then this is its old number Ompront Navy and then that's its former number hopefully you can see that maybe not but it doesn't really matter you can't order it anyway um, and then here's the strap and the strap is like a portion leather and then a portion chain um, and the others are not like that they're either um, all leather or all canvas and then there's the interior so by now you've probably seen this one. I just wanted to show you that it's in my collection now and it joins my others because this is definitely uh, my favorite size and my favorite bag. The other Empreinte one I have, I've shown a lot on my channel and it has a charm on it, so apologies for that. We'll kind of, we can push it to the back a little, but it's still going to be seen. It's the um, 20 in the black Empreinte, but it's the one, the first one that kind of came out that has the pocket in the front right here, which I absolutely love. And if I had to pick my favorite one, um, this is for sure it. I've used this on a lot of different occasions. I find it to be really both casual and more elegant looking, especially if you take the charm off. <laughs> um, but it can serve both purposes. It can look really, really nice and elegant, and it can also look you know, really good for casual wear. And then the other one that I added, which I also like a lot, is this one right here. And I add charms to all of them just to give them a little bit of more personalization and interest. This is the Damier Aben, Damier Aben. And that's also in the size 20. And this is the one that I had in the size um, 25. And then the very last one that I ordered was the more recent one in the blue and green colorway, the Damier Azur colorway that they had out. I haven't had the opportunity to use this one um, very often yet, so I would say of all of them, this is, you know, not my favorite at the moment because it's not one that I've been able to use. Um, but I love this size. I absolutely love it. It fits everything in it. Um, and if you have any questions about it now, I'm the owner of this one, so I can tell you a little bit more about it. And already in the years since this came out, I can see that this one has softened quite a lot in the um, Empreinte leather. And I mean, if you compare it to, for instance, this one that's several years old now, it's still quite firm. So the leather feels much, much thicker on this particular model and much thinner on this one. 
And there's also a bit of a size difference. Um, even though they're both 20s, I can see visually that that older model is a little bit bigger. It just looks bigger overall. So I don't know, yeah, for sure. Because look at the size there, they're both 20s. And you can for sure see a size difference. So did they shrink the 20? I have no idea, it looks like they did. That's a much, much uh, smaller profile on the newer version. So yeah, they must have done some shrinking of the 20, even though they're both known as a 20. Um, but anyway, just wanted to show you that it's now in my collection. If you have any questions about it or maybe how it's wearing, um, let me know and I'd be happy to tell you about that because they're ones that I wear on a very regular basis. I take them on trips with me. I take them to work with me. I take them out on errands with me and just absolutely love them. Um, and I love the versatility of, you know, being able to change out the straps or, you know, add charms and do whatever you want to these bags. I really, really like um, not only Louis Vuitton, but the 20s in particular. So any questions, let me know. Thanks for joining me today and have a good day. Bye-bye.